The NHS is in crisis. Staff are on strike not just because of pay, but because they can see that the system is breaking. How has it got to this? It's, it's just heartbreaking. This is the result of decades of underfunding. Not just of our health service, but of all those other essentials we rely on, such as housing, social care and transport. The NHS is the canary in the coal mine. It is collapsing because it cannot cope with the rising demand for health services. More and more people are unwell due to over a decade of austerity eroding the quality of essential public services. Our housing system is not providing secure, safe homes. Our social care services are not able to support those who are frail, elderly and disabled. Our transport system is failing to connect people with family, friends, jobs and other services and it continues to pollute our air. People aren't dying because nurses are on strike. Nurses are on strike because people are dying. But it doesn't have to be this way. We need to build an economy that is designed to ensure the health and well-being of the whole population. A housing system that provides warm, well-insulated and secure homes, close to essentials such as schools, doctors and reliable transport links, will mean thriving communities. A social care system in which well-trained and well-paid staff provide high-quality care to our elderly and vulnerable relatives will mean a healthier population with care at its heart. A low-carbon transport system with safe routes for cyclists and pedestrians will mean cleaner air, greener cities and better connected, active populations. A healthy, happy and well-cared-for society where everyone has access to the essentials they need will mean less pressure on our NHS. All our public services are deeply interconnected. Human well-being depends on them all being adequately funded and working together to support society as a whole. We call this the social guarantee. In one of the richest countries in the world, we have the resources to deliver it. We can build an economy based on meeting people's needs. An economy that protects the things we care about most, our health, our communities, our planet. The whole point of the NHS is to care for everyone who needs it, from cradle to grave. Let's build an economy that does the same.